Well, hello all you lovely YouTube followers. Here I am again making another video, uh, this time in the camper van, as you can see. Okay, it's the 19th of August, it's 20 past 12, and uh, I'm awake after three hours sleep, following a horrendous drive to and from work. Uh, I had to work elsewhere overnight. Um, so yeah, I've had a few hours sleep and feel absolutely drained. However, things are all good. I'm heading off to North Norfolk. First though, I've got to go to Norwich and fetch Matthias, my German friend who I dived with in South Africa. You may remember seeing him in the van three years ago when uh, he came over to dive in uh, late August and it rained and was cold. Anyway, we've got four degrees better heat now. It's 22 in the water, maybe 23, whereas it was 18 then. Um, the sea's calm, sea's flat, and predicted to be for the rest of the weekend. So we've got a potential, a potential, he says, for six dives, okay? Uh, fingers crossed, because the visibility is looking crap from some bad weather earlier in the week. But we're gonna keep our fingers crossed, and I'm gonna keep you guys posted, and hopefully we'll have plenty of interesting stuff to put on this video. Well, I'm playing the waiting game now. Matthias's bus has been delayed, so it's going to be about half an hour late, which is another 20 or so minutes, 25 minutes, something like that. I'm just around the corner. Um, nice drive over here, nice bright sunny day, and uh, I saw two Spitfires in the wild. Two separate 1500s, about mm, 10 miles apart. So that was really good, really pleased with that. I haven't seen any Spitfires on the road apart from mine for ooh, three years now apart from um, when I did that Triumph Drive at day. So, yeah, all in all, a good day. Just gotta chill out now and wait. Could have done with an extra 40 minutes in bed, though. Well, the police have heard he's here. Well, according to Google Maps Live Location, Matthias's bus has arrived. So I'm gonna go round now, get round and round about and back, and hopefully pull up in the loading area and find him. That's a taxi rank. Oh, there he is, there he is. Look at this, the perfect time. Hello, mate. How are you? Hey. You got more hair than me still. <laughs> must be younger. It's turning great, unfortunately. Ah, oh, well, can't have everything. How are you? <laughs> are you well? Yes. Good flight, bad bus, yeah? You're on video, by the way. Say hello. Say hello. Hello. Or hola, or bonjour, whatever you Germans say. I've suddenly forgotten. <laughs> <laughs> Get out of this fucking city. Look, there's a dinosaur over there. Tyrannosaurus Rex. So my grandfather bought this van a year before he died. And it used to be parked down here by his, by the bottom of his road. So I don't know, right, I don't know if that's free parking. Right, so here we are in Aylsham, just to drive past my grandfather's house where this van used to live. This was this van's first home. And my great grandparents well, built the house or had the house built, yeah. whatever. So this is a house here, on the right. Look at that, yeah. So that's the family home. My father was born uh, top right window there. My grandfather would be appalled at the state of those flowers. Like, absolutely appalled. He tended his roses with such care. Hey, anyway, I've got someone behind me, as always. You always get somebody to mess things up, don't you? This drunken German vandal. Right, Matthias, so you've been traveling all day. So I brought you to the church where my grandparents were married and you're going to try some lovely local food. So it's proper locally made sausage roll and locally made pork pie. So if you'd like to open them up and give us a go. Typical German, he's already drinking, like, drinking in, a, in a graveyard. That's English behaviour actually. You know, it should be cider in a brown paper bag but you know.
Yeah, you could have, if they hadn't sealed the bag, we'd have been fine. So let's have a look at that. How's that looking? Look at that. Ah, what's the outside look at? What's the other side like? Look at that, lovely, lovely. Go on then, try your first ever sausage roll. What do you think? Mm -hmm. Yeah, the German ones are definitely worst, aren't they? <laughs> gotcha, gotcha. Right, time to tuck in the old pork pie then. With the, the, the sort of like boiled, steamed, whatever, pastry. So there's a different type of pastry. That was that was short crust on the other thing. Look at that, what do you think? Look at that. It's nice. And you get the jelly around the edges as well, which I hate, but oh, some people the love. That's the best seat. See, there you go. <laughs> what do you think of that? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Good. Right, well, I'm going to have my, my half and all. I'm glad we only got halves because that would be a lot to have whole ones. So I wasn't overly keen on. Well, the sausage roll was good, but it needed more seasoning, I think. So we're nearly at Weybourne, and I stopped for a bit of foraging. There was elderberries, there's blackberries over there, but I saw something that I thought Mateus had to try. Now, we all know that that's a slow, don't we? So, right, so you're going to take a bite of this, and I'm going to film you nice and close. So, when you're ready, this is one of those foods you think, why would anybody try so hard to find some way of making it edible? Try and be the brave German here. God, he's going for the night's cross, this one. A bit bitter. No, I think that's enough. I think so. <laughs> I think you get a writ of Kreutz. <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen such a such a, 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 a mild reaction to those. Your, your mouth will be dry now for about three hours. Yeah, I'm badass, you know. He's loving all them blackberries. God, he's just eating the one side of the road, now he's eating the other. They are really nice blackberries, to be fair. Could be good to actually pick a load and make a, a blackberry thing up in the van tomorrow night and serve with the custard packets I've got in here as well. He said in Germany, everybody eats them all before they're ready, so you can't eat any, so... Ah, not bad, eh? That's quite a nice, uh, quite a nice composition there. So here we are, back in the car park at Wayborn. Those are new, they weren't here last time you were here. The toilets? Yeah. The wooden one, don't use. Fucking stink. There's a bio one, but they're here. So we're back on the beach. Hey, Wayborn, so let's go see if that sea is going to give us... I mean, the weather's beautiful, isn't it? This is stunning. Look at that. Well, my friend, you've brought the, uh, brought the water with you. That looks all right, that. Oh, I reckon we'll get... We'll have at least three metres of it, which isn't brilliant. I'll probably get five. A little bit murky right in close, but mostly looking good. And that'll be fine once we get out. So that's good. We're on for tonight. You can't see this and it's it's calmed a little bit, but there is fish jumping. Yeah, they're jumping again. I think probably mackerel. Could be bass. Could be something hitting them. Could be a seal under a shoulder mackerel. I've zoomed in, so the quality's crap, but looks like they've sounded again. So here yeah, we are. adjust your towel. Adjust my towel. Just out of the dive. Nice little night dive with Matthias and Nick. I've got my towel on, nothing else. So hopefully that won't all fall out. Cover my breast. So anyway, a weird dive. Couldn't couldn't see further than about here when we dropped down. Didn't get a lot better, got separated, managed to locate the bubbles by going back up and come back down. Stayed with um, Matthias and Nick for all of about one minute and then we lost Nick. That was our fault, we stopped to look at Sol. So, anyway, <laughs> swam along, swam along. Eventually, we got to the rubble around the wreck, and this lobster came out and said, You're here? I was like, Oh, thank you very much. Would you like a lift? Yes, please. So, I said, All right, come along with us. And then uh, a few more came and said hello, and and uh, we ended up quite well to do in the old uh, lobster department. So I've got, I've got five, I put back, or I let go one that was in berry, uh, one, two, three, I don't know how many that I thought mm, were a bit small. Um, yeah, there's loads of small ones around. Coming back was the weirdest thing though. I've got lights on the GoPro and sprats everywhere and they were bouncing off the lights, bouncing oh, off the sweet. mask. It was unbelievable. I've not had that before, that was absolutely amazing. And it was a little baby seal when we first went in as well, little seal pups, that was really cool. But anyway, we're gonna have breakfast waffles with lobster. 
So lobster waffles. Um, yeah. All in all, quite a nice little dive. Hour and a half under water, wasn't it? Well, oh, good night, Matthias. Good night. Matthias or Matthias? Matthias. Matthias. Oh, I always get it wrong. And I'm up there. Oh, I've got the pop top up. So let's turn that vent down a little bit. Up we go.